According to the Amarillo Economic Index, a chart designed to show the patterns of economic activity in the city, Amarillo has not only recovered from the recession, but is enjoying a growth in its economy. It was only last year, in 2013, that the Amarillo Economic Index finally made its way back to its pre-recession high point, so it took us a while to get over that recession. The chart begins tracking Amarillo economic growth in 2000, with a strong increase between 2003 and 2008. Then, of course, the drastic drop known as the recession. Now there is a 0.4% increase in employment growth, a 23% decrease in the unemployment rate, and the housing market continues to grow as well. When you've got job growth and spending growth, you essentially have a growing economy. So we've got all of that, and then we filled in the pieces with construction and our housing market and uh, automobile sales and things of that nature as well. Experts say the success of the economy can be credited to the various industries in Amarillo and the Panhandle area. Well, agriculture is one of the strongest sectors of our economy. We, are, we have got great manufacturing, high quality manufacturing, high paying jobs that really set us apart. We've also been buoyed by an energy boom in the North and East Texas Panhandle and that's been wonderful. And so uh, you, you, you add all that plus a really strong medical sector and we're a very unique community in that regard. And the codependency between the city and the smaller outlying towns creates a unique and prosperous economy as well. Our city is not just an MSA of our local population. We reach all the counties in the entire panhandle. But even as Amarillo begins to attract new growth in the energy and oil and gas sector, the city remains true to its local roots. We have a lot of local banks, a lot of locally owned businesses, and not a lot of a change from outside. So we stick together and we work together and we focus on what's best for our community. Chelsea Goss, Pro News 7.